Okay, what I'd like to do is show you how to take a screenshot of an Autodesk file. And the reason we do that is the screenshot would be just an ordinary JPEG file. Uh, anyone's computer should be able to view this, whereas if you uh, uploaded an Autodesk file, uh, an IPT file, or an IDW file, uh, you have to have Autodesk in order to do that. So when we share our ePortfolios, um, outside of class you can share this with anyone and they can at least see the images. They, they won't be able to rotate the images like you can in Autodesk but you'll at least be able to see uh, what they look like. So what we do is go up to that top left pro icon and go down to export and we're gonna go ahead and export it as an image file. Um, the first thing you want to do here is change the uh, type to JPEG file uh, mine was already selected, but most of them will start as defaulted to BMP files. So just change it to JPEG and then select your folder that you've been saving everything to. Most of you should have this as your uh, flash drive. So just save that to your flash drive like everything else. And in this case, I will save it to IED and screenshots and we hit save and it has basically just saved us a copy of the image as a JPEG so um, if I come down to my IED folder and open up screenshots there it is now what we're gonna do with these image files is uh, insert those into our ePortfolios on Google Sites so that is what you need to do with all of your part files, your assembly files, um, every file that you have for the puzzle cube, uh, you will go ahead and save.